hey guys hey welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Vanessa Nessa Sessa Yaya V all of the above depending who you are um, guys in today's video I'm going to be doing a haul uh, I went a little bit crazy for Black Friday so let's just jump right into the video side note I have COVID um, I'm feeling a lot better today since I'm in quarantine I figured let me just put myself together and do a video for you guys so please give the video a thumbs up because i'm filming a video even though i'm sick okay i got stuff from my outfit online and then look at this i did i did some things i did some damages lots of damages so I order an this is their packaging this was my first time ordering from them they are on the higher quality side therefore the price is on the not I don't think they're super expensive I just think they're around skin prices for 30 years this is the zip up um, sweat shirt it zips fully from top to bottom or you could wear it open and um, these are 100% cotton so they're nice and thick especially for the weather and then I got the wide legs, wide legs pants sweatpants here's the other color which I love um, this is more of a gray color I will say this is like a gray tone color so uh, love 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 I usually follow the instructions that are on the back of these type of clothing um, that's how you know your agent when you start reading <laughs> the instructions on how to wash them and typically these type of 100% cotton they recommend you wash it with cold water and you line dry them or I believe she recommended you tumble dry I'm saying she because I don't really know the owners but they recommend that you I think tumble dry I'm not sure read the tag but I hung mine up I line dry all of my nice quality pieces so keep that in mind why is my camera crooked why didn't you tell me that my camera was crooked the next thing um, I mostly from here on I mostly got t-shirts these basic um, t-shirts i recently went crazy and bought a bunch of them from amazon um jacqueline hill has been raving about a certain brand on amazon so i bought a lot of those i do love them um but i wanted to also check these out because they were on sale so i got this brown color turtleneck long sleeves the sleeves feels thin this one is double lined i can already tell that i would prefer these because it's double lined in the middle but my arms are going to feel a lot breathable so just minor thing and then i got the basic tea in green i do not have this sort of color i do love how it, there's a shape to it so i know it's going to complement your girl body and then um charcoal i got gray in this because i don't i do not have much gray clothing in general uh this year really is the year if you follow me on here i've been talking about it but this is the year that i really got into wearing silver in general so since i never wore silver much i never cared much for gray but i fell in love with gray this year so i got a couple of gray shirts i believe that gray one i got it in two um i got two of that long sleeves and then I got two gray short sleeves. I bought this con right here, which is kind of like a, what, what do you call them, a scoop neck, um, sleeveless top. Initially, I wasn't going to get this, but I saw a few girlies wearing this on their Instagram page, and I really liked how they looked. So I picked that up for myself, just to have variations, because for me, I'm a basic on a regular day i'm a basic girl and i just like to accessorize i forgot i got this dress actually this is nice this feels so soft um but this is just like a basic dress look at the the built-in shape 
so this will be really nice i do not believe it or not i do not have any basic dress like this i do need a long sleeve one especially for this time of the year so i just went ahead and picked that up um and then the last two items in here one is in this brown color Ugh, this color is beautiful so i got this in a long sleeve and i got it in a short sleeve i want more of these color because they are different brown than the skims just to give you guys a bit of a reference this is the skims one and um i the reason why i even switched from getting the fit everybody skims i actually ended up ripping my brown skims fit everybody shirt unfortunately because the fabric is so thin um so it is breathable i feel like this shirt is probably like i like sleeping in it but the problem is it's just way too pricey for me to be sleeping in it um it's still a cool daytime outfit but a daytime shirt but since this rip i've been sleeping in it and the black one my issue with the black one is it's not as dark i love my black clothing to be like really charcoal black so in comparison to colors so you have an idea this one is more on like the cooler side and the skims one is more showing more warm undertone me personally i like the the my outfit shade of brown because it's on that cooler tone a more neutral cooler side um i think it's flattering it's going to be flattering on my skin and then lastly this is the only color i got in this um i don't really care too much for the color but still cute um and that's that's it that's everything i got from my outfit online i'm turning 30 next year so a lot of the other stuff that i purchase is for my trip my 30th birthday trip but i'm not showing you guys the items that i'm purchasing um for my trip because i want it to be a surprise i'll film a video for you guys um closer to my birthday trip and then i'll probably make that live when i'm on my trip i'm gonna be going to cabo y'all so i'm excited but i'll show you guys this top because i've been eyeing this top for a while and i finally decided to get it so because it was on sale it's from mishk i never know if i'm saying the name right so i apologize if i'm not saying the name right blink blink and link and link and link and link and link and link look at this gorgeous look at that yeah i did try it on already because it seemed pretty wide to me when i first pulled it up but it's good it fits nicely i did get it in a size small and what i like about this initially when i tried it on is that there's like a satin material on the inside or there's like a fabric on the inside i'm not sure if it's satin but it's really nice because i hate when these type of tops are like the same material on the inside and it's hell uncomfortable and cold on you um i'm sorry if this screen is crooked i'm hoping it's not I ho i'm hoping my camera is not leaning lean with it rock with it. <laughs> i hope it's not leaning but yeah so the fabric on the inside of this feels very comfortable which i love um the straps the arm straps i think could be better be they feel kind of the strap feels kind of cheap like the bra strap area and this stuff is really expensive so i just wish the strap itself had been made better it almost feel like it was just like hot glue on the strap like so i'm just being careful with it but the rest of it feels really nice the details are really great so i'm really excited about this piece i have a drawer of clothes that i'm taking a cobble so i'm just going to put this right up in there i did restocked on i did restock on my fenty so i'll sh quickly show you guys of course i took the face cream out i've showed that to you guys multiple times so it's not a big deal i did get finally get her blotting powder my sister really is 
kind of why I decided to pick this up because she always carries it with her. Um, so I decided to finally pick this up. And this is just her, the Fenty Beauty Blotting Powder because I do get oily. But baby, this face I did today, yo, I took my time and I put a lot more layer on. Usually I try to do like a light layer, but I went ham today because I feel like on camera, you know, you have to put a lot more makeup so it shows up on camera. So let me know how it looks in this video. I restacked on the fat water. I do love her fat water it's just because of the application and then it's very hydrating. This is the hydrating kind that I got. That's why I picked it up. Um, this is the Hydro Visor Refill. I already have one in the bathroom that I already refilled. And then I decided to pick up a Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. Um, and I keep forgetting that I purchased this. I would have tried it already, but I keep forgetting. So that's kind of why I wanted to do this haul because I've had these items sitting around and I want to put them away. So that's Fenty. Now let's move into Fashion Nova. I'm going to show you guys this because I technically didn't purchase this. My boyfriend bought himself essential sweatsuits and he accidentally purchased two of the pants. Lucky me because now I have an essential sweatpants. And this is just what it looks like. It's the nude color. It looks really gorgeous. And on the front, it just says fear of God. Um, this pair with one, maybe like this, oh, would be so cute. For the holiday, the holiday season, yo, I got like 15 pair of jeans from Fashion Nova. I actually have two downstairs in another bag. They sent me two large bags because I ordered so much jeans. Y'all know I always do a Fashion Nova haul for you guys because I always make like a large purchase like once a year or maybe once a year and a half. Um, and your girl has gotten thicker, which I'm not mad at totally. Why well, I used to be a size six and seven from Fashion Nova or five and seven, however their sizes were. Five and seven, seven was like if I wanted a looser fit um, or if it was 100% cotton and I needed room in those pants because you know if it's 100% cotton, you wanna size up. If it's not 100% cotton and it has spandex in there, then you can get your usual size. That's what I do when I'm on their side. So now your girl is wearing a size nine a 7.9 is what I'm wearing. A 7 for my regular size. A 9 for if I want a looser fit. Um, but some of these jeans were not fitting like a loose fit for a size 9. It was really fitting. Fitting, fitting. <laughs> I'm mad at it. This is the first pair of jeans. This one was different for me because typically I tend to be... I don't know I, I'm I'm trying to step more into my creative side and just not be so I don't yeah let's just keep it there so when I saw this jeans I wanted to give it a try and so I bought it it's laced down the side um, it fit really nicely I love how it, it has my hips sitting uh, this one kind of fits more so on the mid not a high rise like a mid rise um, it's kind of how it fit closer to the low rise. So if you like high waisted jeans, this one is a mid. The package I have downstairs are jeans that I am returning. So there were two jeans in there. One I wasn't too impressed with and the other one I just didn't like the fit. So I'm going to be returning those. And those laced up jeans are a size 9. The next one is also a size 9. I actually really, really love this jeans. And I knew I would when I saw it on the side. It's just very edgy. Um, pockets here. It's more for cargo pants. And it has a strap at the very bottom. It's not like a wide. It's not like a um, flare out pants. It's more so like a straight, loose fit. But it's nice because it fits my waist and my hips area really nicely. And then it's loose the rest of the way, which is ideal for me. So I love that. And it's like a nice um, blue wash jeans. Love, love, love. Next up, this one is a little bit plain jean. This is the In That Sw it's Fashion Nova. Like, it's not that deep. In That Sweet 
tainted baggy jeans that's too much i don't care for the jeans name to be that long y'all need to chill out this one is just like like i said plain little jean plain jean um but i love the wash of it that's why i kept it it is a plain basic everyday type of jeans once again it's not flare i don't think i got any flare jeans i just got straight relaxed jeans that's where i made my life that's where 30 is taking me apparently um yeah so i just like the color of this uh slightly on the looser end like i can wear that go and eat a whole lot and still feel healthy next up i like these jeans also um charcoal gray jeans i'm gonna be trying all of these on for you guys you're welcome um so these are I, I really like how the leg of this goes down there are a few outfits that i've had in mind over the past few months that needed this sort of fit of a jeans that are just and once i have an outfit in mind i need to get that outfit out of my head so this one is a size seven um and because it is on the baggy side or stretchy side i knew that a seven would be fine next up we have what's this one called make you my make you mine non-stretch straight leg jeans this is the make you mine jeans okay straight leg once again um basic just this one has like a little bit of a distress up front and the end were roughly cut as a style so you know every jeans has something unique about it uh you may not be able to tell but i can and the pockets also have like more distress next up another cargo pants these are size seven um and they are similar to those first pair of pants the first blue pants i show you guys that had like the the what you call it strap at the bottom except these have the large pockets in the front and i love the shade of blue this is that rich blue i don't think i have a nice yeah i don't think i have this color in my collection at all so this is the year where we are you know we're expanding on the jeans those just have so much pockets and the pockets in the front at the bottom you could sneak that's this is a movie theater pants right here this is the type of pants you wear when you're going to like a theme park you go into the movie and you need to sneak a few snacks in i could sneak a whole baby in this online but you could sneak i i was telling babe this you could you could put a diaper in here a change a diaper you could put your kids change your clothes in here <laughs> but not nah, for real this is the movie theater pants because you got pocket right here you got a little mini pocket where you can put candy in here you can put like popcorn in here you could put something else in here you can put something else in here and wear a trench coat you gucci i just saved y'all like 50 dollars next up these black jeans i recently got rid of um this is a mom jeans that i've had for years but the black one were just way they, they've gotten tight for me pretty much so since i really like the fit of this and the style it's just a basic jeans i decided to get another one it's called It's cool. I got it from my mama. Wish I did get it from my mama. So I got it in a size nine because I had it in a size seven before. No, I think I had it in a in a bit tighter size. So they're just taper. They go down um, and taper. And you could either unravel them or keep them raveled up. So next up, we got this light gray jeans black jeans are so hard to like find um black jeans gray jeans are really difficult to find for me like finding a nice black or gray jeans that i genuinely just love has just been difficult to find i think i have like not even one black jeans in my collection or nice black jeans mostly i wear black pants a lot that's what's back there so these like this sweater 
gray color it's just really cute to have i just think you can style like your outfit would just look different with this shade of gray same similar to the other jeans i had i don't know if they're the same kind it's called no worth the weight rip strip jeans i might cut it in the back like where the booty is i might do that with one of these jeans that would be cute Similarly to black jeans, same thing for white jeans. When I went on Fashion Oversight, I actually went to look for like one or two white jeans and one or two black jeans. That's why I went on there. Um, but keep in mind, they were on a Black Friday sale. These jeans, each of them were like they ran me about $25 ish around there, $30, which is really cheap. And keep in mind, I always donate stuff when I don't want them. Um, white jeans. These are nice cargo white jeans. I really like this one. Really, really like this one. It has like the buckle right here on the pockets on the side. Straight goes down. Um, and yeah, it has the threads on this jeans. My battery died, so I had to change it. Let's hurt. we got like three more jeans left, so we're almost there. But what I was saying was the thread on here are brown, which adds like a nice um different look to that pen. This white pants, babe, like this one. I don't know if I love it yet, but we'll see. It's hard for you to see on the camera, but once again, it has all these pockets. Um, I like the look of the pants. It's just the fit of it. I'm gonna try it on for you guys and just let you know how I feel. It just felt a little bit more tighter around the hips area. So I'm gonna try it on and see if I choose to keep that. Um, next up, we have Wear Better Together Distressed Boyfriend Jeans. This is, um, I don't know why they call it a boyfriend jeans because it's not like it was fitting me like a boyfriend jeans. Them cargo pants fit a little bit more like a boyfriend pants than this one. Um, but this was cute. This dress also, one more can I say? I'm gonna do let the try on speak for itself. And then second to last is the West End Drop, the West End Drop Waist Baggy, whatever. <coughs> My throat's starting to hurt. So I'm speeding through this. Oh, I know what this one is. So I have a blue jeans that I bought from Good American. Love it. It's oversized. Might not be everybody's look, but I like it. So I wanted that style of jeans in a uh, black so that's why i purchased this it's kind of those that baggy wear it when you're being extremely lazy with a crop top or if you want that baggy type of look that's what this is giving so that is why i purchased and then the last one and that's a size nine the last one is also like a charcoal gray jeans and this one is um similar to other ones we've seen with the pockets 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 um they all kind of have that same finishes uh just different color one of the jeans downstairs i'm gonna look in the back and like put the name on the screen just so you guys have an idea guys the pins the reason why i'm sending it back is because it comes up to like here if i want the crotch to sit where the crotch is meant to sit and I was really confused because I bought it in like a size 7 yeah that's a size 7 and I'm like why is a 7 pants this huge like I know we're going down the baggy I don't know valley for women which I I'm all for I'm all for um but those were just a little bit way too like odd that's why i'm returning it just keep an eye out if you do choose to wear it i don't even think it's one of those where if you size down i think the from the crotch to the waist it's just way too it's for a tall person it's not for an average if you have a tall torso 
to waist ratio you love it that's everything that i i am sharing with you guys today um i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did give it a thumbs up just give it a thumbs up in general for your girl filming this video while she has covid okay so i'll catch you guys when i catch you stay humble stay fashionable and bye guys